Hello, my viewers. I uh, got a request some time back about showing or illustrating what is common, meaning what is a common wire in, say, an air conditioning system. Uh, now, common, meaning common wiring, is used in single phase, not free phase uh, type systems. Uh, although, you may have a common side of a transformer, you know, that is a control transformer, or uh, a common side of a single phase motor, even though the system does have like a three phase compressor or something like that. But anything single phase will always have a common side to it. And the best way I can show is, well, by showing in an in illustration. Here it goes. Now let's take a look at the typical wiring diagram on a residential heat pump where I can show you where some of the common terminals are that are most common. One would be right here where it shows the compressor. This, this is the common terminal. According to this compressor here, the purple wire is going to be the common side on this terminal block. And then let's take a look over here at the run capacitor which also has a common terminal. The common side of the run capacitor is right there. See where the red wire is and the black wire is connected? And right here on the outdoor fan, which would be like the condensing fan motor, this terminal right here would be your common terminal. It doesn't have a little C on it, but it is. It's a common terminal. On this condensing fan motor, it calls for wire number 27, which in this case is the black wire. Now let's take a look at the low voltage part where uh, here's the common terminal. And here's the common terminal right here, this blue wire. Sometimes it's black, but in this case it's blue, which is in the condensing unit on the low voltage terminal strip. Uh, as you can see, it's, the wire's black, which it usually is. Sometimes it, you'll find it blue, but typically if it's wired properly, it will be black. And let's follow where this goes, okay? Let's see, we're going all the way up to over, see it's still black, here where we're connected to the common terminal on the defrost board. This uh, black wire connects to the common terminal on the defrost board. And what that is connected to, any contact or relay has a connection where the common side is connected. Okay, now on a control transformer such as this one, depending on the primary line voltage that you're using, okay, depends on which wires you use. For example, here, okay, your common wire is going to be black. That's right here. That would is what you would connect to, say, like your um, neutral wire if you're using 120 volts, or you would just connect it to one side of uh, like 240 volts if uh, your line voltage is 240 volts. Here we go. Now, if, like I said, your common will always be black, no matter which one of these voltage years you're using, 120, 240, 277, or 480. Now, if your line voltage is 120 volts, you would be using the black as your common and the white right here, okay, um, for the other wire that would be necessary to connect to. And if your primary is 240 volts, then you would use the black for your common again, and the orange, though, for your uh, other side. That would be, so that would be uh, black and orange is what you'd use. In this case, then, if your primary voltage happens to be 277, 
you'd use black as common and yellow as the other wire. That would be this one right here, of course. And then if your primary voltage is 480, then you would use black as common and the gray, this one right here, okay, would connect to the other wire. And you see it tells you here your secondary voltage is 24 volts at 60 VA. And in this case, it says blue and brown. Notice it does not tell you which color is common. And that's because it doesn't really matter which one you use in this case as your common wire. Now the blue wire is the red one here now. See, I had to take and put a uh, butt connector on here to make it work. Um, this was blue, but now it's red. But anyway, so you can take any one of these wires and make it your common wire. It doesn't matter as long as the other is carrying your 24 volts. One thing you should not do is confuse the common side of the compressor thinking it would go on the common side of a run capacitor and it does not. It simply goes to uh, well right here for example to T2 and where your run side right here gets connected to T1 and right here your start side gets connected let's follow this down to the herm side which is hermetic or the compressor side of the run capacitor and the common side of the run capacitor however does get connected to T1 okay which also gets connected to your uh, run side.